Alright guys, today I'm going to make a burrito and a taco on my outside black stone griddle. Alright, those are black beans. I drained them mostly. You got lettuce and tomato. Got your ground beef, tacos, cheese. I have more cheese too. I have another bag of cheese somewhere. Tacos, burritos. You get it. Alright, let's go out there. I'm going to turn it on for the first time since <laughs> probably September of last year. All right. Turned it on. Looking good. All right. All right, guys. I'm going to hit it with some Evo oil sprayer. That's some olive oil. All right. It's good. Alright guys, let's start with my onions. Season it with this. Now I'm going to add my black beans. Boom. Alright guys, about six minutes have passed. Give it a taste and make sure it's to your liking. I'm gonna add some hotter hot sauce from Texas Pete. I don't know about that. Alright guys, so I went ahead and put that on low. So now we're ready to make our tacos and burritos, basically. Put it with some oil in. Yeah.
Alright, at this point I turned the fire off completely. I'm going to put this Mexican blend on there. Let that melt. Put my meat on. Now, of course, I'm gonna have a lot of leftovers, so it's all good. That's what I want. Nice. All right, guys. Now I'm gonna put some sharp cheese on the top of this. Don't laugh at me, y'all. I bought this a long time ago and I wanted to use it and today is the day. <laughs> Give you a better view. All right, now I'm gonna add my lettuce and tomato. I'm sorry about this, guys. My neighbor decides to mow his lawn and it's almost about to rain. So, hey, God bless him. <laughs> at least he's mowing the lawn. I can't even fault them. Alright, almost done guys. And we'll bring this in and have a bite. You know how we do. Alright guys, we're going to uh, clean this up. We're going to um, season it with some olive oil after we're done. And we're going to have a bite. By the way, if you're interested to know how it comes out, you slide it out. Slide out your taco. Shout out to my Kitchen Gadgets group on Facebook one time. Alright guys, I'm starving. So, let's just go ahead and take a bite. You got it? Pretty good. My very first taco, y'all. <laughs> I made on my own. Mmm. Good. All right, guys. This is big and sloppy. You got it? Take a bite, man. All right. Mm-hmm. That is all right. Y'all got to take one more bite with me. My duck style burrito. Might not look the best, but it tastes... Dang good. Take another bite, y'all. Mmm. 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 Oh, yeah. Well, that was fun, guys. Of course, I'm going to have the other burrito and the other um, taco uh, tomorrow for lunch or dinner, whatever. I don't know. Whenever I want to eat it. But this should be enough for me uh, for tonight. Just having fun with my Blackstone outside grill and griddle. Um, it's awesome. If you are in the market for an outside. Now, what's great about that Blackstone that I have is a 22-inch. I mean, you could fold it up in your car. You can bring it with you camping. You could put it in an RV, blah, 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 blah. It's a small footprint. But I love it. 
um, just gives you the flexibility of doing what you want to do outside and you don't have to use a traditional grill if you don't want to. Or you could use it, I like to use it alongside my um, grill. Like if I'm making burgers on a grill, I can make bacon on my griddle, my Blackstone, and onions and, and so forth. You get the point. Guys, if you have an Instagram, uh, look me up there, Cooking with Doug. But that's all I got, guys. Hit like if you like it. Remember to subscribe. And if anything, thanks for just even looking at my video. If you're interested in the Blackstone, I have a link in the description, as well as my oil sprayer and whatnot. All right? It's Cooking with Doug, and I'm out.